the third century theologian and ecclesiastic writer Tertullian wrote the following words, which became famous in the church's history. He said, The blood of Christians is sea. He meant that every time a Christian is martyred in defense of the faith, this brings others to become Christians, just like a seed that bears much fruit after dying in the ground. Stephen is the first martyr that led to the conversion of many. Jesus, receive my spirit. Lord, lay not this sin to their charge. Today's first reading, preceded yesterday by the death of Stephen by the Sanhedrin, it says, There broke out a severe persecution of the church in Jerusalem, and all were scattered through the countryside of Judea and Samaria. The disciples were all scattered to spread their newfound faith in Jesus and the gospel in the process. The expansion of the church began with the death of Stephen. And the Twelve Apostles themselves suffered so much persecution that 11 of them died as martyrs. The blood of Christians is seed. The parable of the mustard seed has taught us that even small beginnings result in enormous outcomes. lives, we may think that our actions are small and insignificant as they appear. For example, smiling even if we do not feel like it, or helping with the dishes even if we are tired from the day's work, or waking up early to accompany our loved one to the market even if we came home late the night before, or lending a listening ear even if we are busy with our own work. But our humble actions are the seeds that we plant today that will surely yield us a harvest of believers and become an avenue of transformation. 
Let us plant small seeds around us beginning today. Let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Heavenly Father, grant us the grace to make every effort to sow seeds of kindness and goodness around us. For we know that all these small actions add up to a world of conversion. We pray in Jesus' holy and mighty name. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless your families, brothers and sisters. God bless couples for Christ.